All right, guys. So we have here. This is a new old stock uh, MSI 8800 GTX. I'm sorry, GTS video card. I do have a GTX also, um, <clears throat> but I was attracted to this because I just happened to find it on eBay, browsing one day, and uh, found this guy new inbox. I actually bought two of them. I am planning to do an upcoming SLI build. Here's the other one. <clears throat> but I got a really good deal on these. They were only uh, like 38 bucks each. Actually, less than that, I think, because I paid like 78 altogether, uh, including shipping. So I'm going to go ahead and open this up for you guys. Let's take a look at it. So I also got a uh, NVIDIA 680i, S 680i, yeah, SLI port. I'm going to be using with this. <coughs> I haven't gotten that yet. All right, there we, there we have the card. You can see the packaging is brand new. All right, let's take a look at the box a little bit. So what does it say? We got 640 megabytes of DDR3, dueling DVI, TV out, dual DVI, nice. HGTV ready. Essentials for Vista. <laughs> So we got a full game inside, Company of Heroes. Never played that. So I'll have to check it out. Let's see what the back of the box says. Double your performance with NVIDIA SLI technology. Well, I don't know if you'll well, actually double it, but uh, see how that works. Hopefully it'll be able to play some Crisis. Features. We got uh, 16X, full screen anti-aliasing. True 128-bit floating point. Dynamic range HDR can output 2560 by 1600. Nice. Anyways, you guys didn't come here for me to read the box, but uh, that's that. Let's get to the to the good part. Let's go ahead and take this guy out. There's the card. the seal here. <clears throat> Very nice. I love this era of cards. And they don't, um, the cards these days are so boring looking. And this is cool, you got like cool graphics and I like the fan design. We got our two DVI connectors. Right, go ahead and leave those on there. <coughs> All right. Let's see what else is in the box here. There we got our game. Exclusive two disc edition. Hmm. 96% on PC Gamer. Cool. Let's check that out. Right, so we got that. Probably driver CD. Beyond 3D. Because it's like 4D. Looks like we got a S video to composite out. DVI to VGA adapter. S video cable. And six pin to Molex adapter. Pretty standard stuff here. What else do we have here? Quick user's guide. We have several languages. Oh, cool. 
Gotta look at MSI's <coughs> notebook here. Oops. Sorry, it's all blurry. I'm filming this with a potato. But, looks like, uh, well, we got some AMD Turion based? Or Core 2 Duo. Yeah. Makes sense. Santrino Duo. <coughs> so, very cool. We got two of these DV, DV out of these adapters. Oh, I'm gonna leave the discs out because I will be using this. <coughs> All right, let's go throw it in a system. This is the system I have for right now that I'm going to test out in. <clears throat> this is a uh, old Lenovo business PC. Uh, I've been running Windows XP on it. Uh, but it's got a, a Xeon. can't remember the exact model. But it's uh, you know equivalent to like a first gen uh, core processor. Uh, it's a LGA thirteen sixty six socket. I'm just gonna take out the old video card. So this is a gigabyte uh, HD seventy eight seventy, I believe. <coughs> That's the old gigabyte card. Not exactly error appropriate for what I'm going for. Alright, let's go ahead and pop in the uh, 8800 here. I think I gotta pull these covers off first. This guy only needs one six pin connector. this uh, particular model for some reason. It's a ThinkStation S20. But yeah, let's go fire it up. Alright, so let's go and fire it up.
the CMOS battery must be dead. We'll go ahead and uh, use the box drivers. Mouse and keyboard don't seem to be working. All right, we're back. So now the mouse needs to be working. I don't know what was going on before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No AMD card detected. So I wonder if it already found new hardware. Let's go ahead and get that uh, get that CD going here. Should be easier to see. Let's go and install these drivers. So apparently, I, I must have had an NVIDIA card in here before. It's been a while since I used the system. I don't remember having an NVIDIA. I do have an 8800 UTX. Maybe I had that in there at one point. I can't remember. Alright, come on. I'm curious about what this MSI utility is.
Uh-oh. Alright, let's go ahead and reboot. Okay, back at the desktop here. Gonna go ahead and launch a uh, beer. Let's go quick put benchmark in there. everything out. Let's do a quick benchmark here. Average is 70 FPS. It's pretty good. Pretty decent. 